Right, I want to demonstrate how to um, uh, sew quarter inch hexagons. These are the quarter inch hexagons here. They're really quite small. Um, this miniature hexagon patchwork is actually lovely to work on. It looks very fiddly, but actually once you get going on it, it's, um, it's quite, quite easy and um, you can move along quite fast. Um, what I'm going to demonstrate is just how you get to this point here. Here's a um, piece that um, I created earlier. It's only a small piece. So I'm just working on it now. And if you look at the back, you can see that as well. Right, so what we need to do, we have our fabric here. And I want to um, cut the fabric around the hexagon. I've, I'm doing several pieces of fabric at once just to save a bit of time here. So I place the... Um, hexagon in the centre there and just cut it around just a little bit. You need quite a bit of um, seam allowance on here, it's quite helpful to have a bit of seam allowance on there. Like so. I'm just going to cut around like that. So of all those horrible little bits there. So here we, here's my hexagon right in the center of a piece of the fabric. Um, this is the right side of the fabric. This is the, That's the right side, the shiny side. I'm using glazed cotton chintz. Um, this is the, the wrong side. I place the hexagon in the center just like so there and with my very fine needle I fold over the first edge of the paper hexagon and fold over the second edge. Um, I bring the needle up from behind and down again and up up once more. That just that just holds it in place. Now Feeling the fabric over the paper gently and accurately fold over twice more like that and then bring your thread up through and down again. right around and so we're back to where we started again um, just a, a little stitch here and down again and there we have the perfect hexagon I know it's perfect because if I place um, another cut template over the top of it there should not be any edges showing there we go that's exactly accurate so once I've got several of these done I can start sewing them together um, 